Good evening, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to Bartel Road Gymnasium for the match between the visiting Lansing Stars and your Muskegon Lady Jayhawks in a conference match here. Lansing, 8-8 eight eight overall, 4-5 in the league. Jayhawks, uh, rough weekend last weekend, but off a conference win Tuesday night in Jackson, a 3-0 sweep. We're trying to get back uh, on a winning track tonight at home, the fine, comfortable confines of uh, their home gym. So we'll see what we come here. The last time they played in Lansing, it went five. So Jayhawks, 10-13 uh, and 13 overall with an 8-1 and one conference record. Just trailing behind Grand Rapids, which they visit Grand Rapids here on the 10th of October, so a week from Tuesday. And they actually head off to Grand Rapids this weekend for the Raider Invitational Saturday and Sunday. They'll play Schoolcraft, Henry Ford. W. Ash opens it up. Nice pass up, goes outside. Through the hole in the block for the first time. Nice, nice swing by Casey Richmond out of Mason High School, a sophomore. Got number four, Aaron Cooper, back to serve. Nice set. Well, pass about the 12 foot line. Oh, a helicopter pad there and tips it in the middle from Julie Brown for a kill, and she goes back to third and oh. tied at one. That ball should not be landing in the court. Not, not that easily. Blocked there by the Jayhawks. Covered. Keeps it in play. Bernia. Out to Berg. High off the hands of the block. For a Good play. Uh, Robbie Berg matched up against uh, the 5-4 freshman setter from Mount Pleasant. Jaslyn Maxson. So that's a... Robbie's a very springy 5-7. Back. Just a bit long there by a set. Lexus is set. Number 14, Myra Brooks in. Number three, the setter, Maxson. Back to serve, serves it out. 3-2 Jayhawk lead. Katie Veal back to serve for the Jayhawks. Katie's been working on her short serve. It's pretty tempting right now, but she's going to serve it deep. Ball's back about 12 foot line. She back throw, attack, out to Berg, tip. And got somebody in the net for Lancey. So, 4 2. 14 in the net there, Maya Brooks. Mm -hmm. Holds up, we go back out. It's going to be 4. Four hits all day long. Yeah. Didn't clear the net. Number 9, McKenzie Kent. Didn't get it over. And Katie Veal with a couple of points on her serve. Goes back to serve. There comes that short one. Picked up. Nice set. Down the line. What? So a four-point run, or a three-point run on the serve for Katie Veal. Another nice short mm -hmm. serve. And the hands picked up by Rouse. Veal. Back to Bernie now. Maybe a double there, but... Berg, hard to the block. Be a timeout coming here, maybe not. Emily Quintero, she's been in Lansing for a few years now. Yep. Jayhawks with a 7-2 lead. Oh. Well, that may, that may bring, bring a timeout. Ball dropped right in between two players. That's not a good sign. Oh, 
Here it comes again. Passes it up. Oh, there's a touch on the block there. Set. Nice nice touch. We keep that in play. Oh. Well, that drops that down a there. Fortunate point for the Stars is that was the Jayhawks' point to win and just didn't quite. Raylan sells in for Bernia. So Raylan will go and play the right side. Berg with a roll shot down the line, catching nice Shifton in their defense. So Berg back to serve with uh, Bennett, Delaney Bennett in. Robbie, good jump serve. Eight. Gets the ace, yeah. Ten three timeout. Yeah. Good turn out, a little late, but Jayhawks playing a little bit better today. Kind yeah. Of getting in system, I think. Finally getting this rotation yeah. down maybe a little bit. I think Coach Rixie's made a couple adjustments and he's changed up a few things for sure. And things are starting to work out, I think. Giving them some different looks and some different options. So move Bennett from the right side to the left side and insert itself. And Quick time out there by the, the Stars. Mm -hmm. yeah. Didn't have much to say other than wake up and pass the ball. Yeah. Robbie Berg out of the timeout. One of the best servers in the conference. Got a wicked jump serve. And scores a lot of points with it. Good control over it. Another tough serve. That's an over. Oh, there's a set. Got to be ready for that. Bennett across court. Picked up. Put back on the right side. Picked up, but not good enough. Kind of a little bit of a panic there. And yeah. So much needed side out for the Stars. 4-10 here in the first set, best out of five. Good deep serve. Oh. Set's a little low, a set has to keep it in play. Good cross. Ball in the net. Raylan Sells in the net for point five ten. And number two, Alana Mantai back to serve. That's about twelve foot serve. wide. Yeah, Robbie out of the back row, sprays it wide, and all of a sudden a quick three three points for the Stars in ten six. It's been one of the Achilles heels for the Jayhawks this year, too, letting teams go on runs. So, nice right. pass. Oh, 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 back row attack. Got Sylvia Strife coming in. Sammy Oxra back to serve, up 11-6. Good serve. Passed up outside. Good swing picked up by Berg. Bennett makes it through the block to 12 6. So they've doubled them up here in the first set, 12 6. Oxford back to serve. New short one. Bump set. Up to number four, rolls it off the block. Berg up to Veal. Bennett pushes it, picked up easily by the Libro. It's a little short, picked up by Bennett. Brown tips it over. Back set, picked up by Berg. Veal back to Sells, puts it over. Cooper, Bennett. Got a cut, and it was in, so that was a good long rally win for the Jayhawks there. Yeah. 13-6, Oxter again back to serve. Yep. That's the double, yeah. Got to call that. Yep. 
the right goal. Mm -hmm. Not a great set. 14-6. Mm -hmm. Nobody over six foot on the uh, Stars lineup back. That ball's got to come yeah. up. Yeah. Number five, Sylvia Strife taps a little tappy and finds the wood. Serve. Oh, this pickup. Keep it in play. In the back. High off the hands and the block. Number, number 13 is pretty solid. Yeah, she is. Freshman. Madison David out of Holt High School. So we notice we have three of three players from Holt. All freshmen. Mm -hmm. Berg up. Veal. Not quite high enough. Brown keeps it in play. Not enough, not high enough either. And gets blocked. Mernia in to serve for the Jayhawks, leading 15 8 here in the first set, going to 25 points. Really Good. nice serve. Great tough serve. Set to the back row. Easy ball to pick up. Yield to Brown. Lock. Pick back up. Mernia calls for it. Oxford puts it in. Picked up. Setters out the, off the block. That's going to be close. Picked up by Veal. Put in. Back over. Blocked by Brown. Picked up again. Bennett. Comes back. Another long rally won by the Jayhawks. And Kennedy, Kennedy Burney are back to serve. Up 16 8. Serve, picked up. Sets a little low. Step back, Burney out of the back row. So, nice swing. Timeout number two for the Stars. Hey, Hawks, Stars just haven't gotten any kind of sync whatsoever. Passing's been a little off and. Uh, the long rallies have been won by the Lady Jayhawks so far today. Jayhawks. Like we mentioned earlier, won 3-0 on the road against Jackson the other night. They're off to the Raider Invitational this weekend. Or an eight and one conference record. And the Lansing Stars are four and five in conference. Lansing Stars out of timeouts here in the first set. Bayhawks just need eight more points to win it. Uh, Cardinal Sun coming out of the timeout is serving the ball out of bounds. And that's what happened there. So 9-17. Madison David back to serve. Nice block on right there by Veal. Tip and play, Vernia to Veal, out to Bennett. High, hard, but out. Just a bit long. It's a good swing there, but yeah, uh, got all of that one. Put a little heat on it. Just sprayed it a little long. Serve that one long. Hard to get a rally going when you when you get one point off your service. So 18-10 with Shelby Rash back to serve. 
here in set number one. And she does the same thing, gives it right back to him. Number four, Aaron Cooper back to serve. Where's Langsburg, Michigan? 11, down by Nancy. 11, 18. Probably should have called the set, but they got a net, so one way or another they start to grab a point. 12 18. Cooper back to serve. Rouse, nice pass up, deal. Brown. Oh, nice pickup by the setter. One arm, man. It. Berg, picked up by the lead, bro. Setter, huh? way early on the good. Oh, boy. No, com no complaints out of the yeah, Lansing coach there. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. That was not pretty. 19-12, Julie Brown back to serve, trying to close out set number one. Good serve. Going outside to number 12. Cool off the block. Mm -hmm. Number 12, Casey Richmond, a sophomore out of Mason High School. Number three, Jaslyn Maxson, setter out of Mount Pleasant, back to serve. Bird flips the block easily, puts it deep, 2013. That was a nice swing there. Oh. Nice gap in the block. Kitty Veal back to serve. She's run up some service points this set. And a steep serve. And down the line they go, number 12, Casey Richmond. Out, number one, Hannah Whitman back to serve. That's a nice turn down the line by her. 14-20. Picked up by a set. Dubbed over by Berg. Out to number nine. Off the cells. So a point, 15-20. So the Stars trying to creep back in late in the first set. Rouse with a nice set up. It's just going back. There's a bird the off the block. Comes up behind the middle and a uh, little eye there and a uh, good kill. And she gets a uh, kill to give herself the ball to serve. So 21 15. Good deep serve. Nice set. Madison Davis. Nice turn down the line there. The heat on that one down the line. Pretty nice pass there by Aaron Cooper. Yep. Kind of threw her hands up and number two turned out to be pretty good. Juana Mantai out of New Lothrop. Good deep serve. Robbie Berg brings it right up. Nice job. Straight up by the lead girl. Picked up by Hoxha, nice up by a set, back over by uh, Hoxha. Gives it to David, oh, and nice 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 pick up by Veal. Gonna work out of the back row for Robbie Bird. Lansing kind of settling into their own a little bit. Jeremy Hoxha back to serve. Strife in for Brooks. 22-16, three points away from set one. Nice serve. Yeah. Great serve by Sammy Hawks. Two points away, 23-16. Sammy gets the signal from the bench where to put it. And that'll work. And I don't know if that's what they told her, but it certainly works. The net trickle ace and gives her a handful of uh, set points here in set one 24 16 Lady Jayhawks and the set that one. Good high swing, that ball was down before. Yeah. Well, David gives him a side out and saves one set point and 17 24 is another one for 
the Lady Jayhawks. Like the Hawkstra serves a little short. Bennett rolls it in. The spot deep in the corner. Nice spot there. Yeah. That, she's pretty solid. Yeah, she's, she's probably their most effective offensive weapon in my book. Stars just got it going late a little bit here. They were down 10 3. Didn't help. Yeah. Baby Zero out. Julie Brown. Picked up by Berg. Veal out to Brown on the outside. 25 18 Jayhawks. Set number one. Best three out of five. Jayhawks will need to win two more games to 25 to wrap up the match. Send us home for the 7 o'clock dinner. Right. Jayhawks going to see if they can keep the momentum rolling here and take set number two. Stars using all the time there in between games. Well, so here we are, new set two. We'll see what happens if the Stars don't put themselves in such a deep hole to start with, if they can make a more competitive set out of it, or if the Jayhawks are going to use their home court advantage, as they usually do, to uh, play real well at home. The last four or five years have had a Awesome record, only lost a handful of times here. Heidi Julie Brown to start it off, set her outside to number four. Nice save. Good hustle there, good, good dig. Yeah. Number 10, Morgan Daly coming in for the Stars. Looks like Casey Richmond might have twisted her ankle a little bit. Number one, good tough serve. Passed up by Roush Berg. Off the block. Good kill. High off the hands. 2 1. Ran him on in the middle. This set. Julie Brown puts it in the net. Aaron Cooper back to serve for the Stars. Up 2-1. Second set. Right through the block there. Good set. Just a little bit of a hole in the block there, but a yeah. good elevation and good swing there by Robbie Burr. 2-2. Edie Veal back to serve. And that's going to go wide for 3 2. Nobody home on the back side mm -hmm. there. Mm -hmm. Somehow that one snuck through the block. Mm -hmm. Fells in for Bernie, huh? And Max in the third block and third high off the block. Send it in for Roush with Bird back to serve. Down 3-4. She misses. So three five. That jams Sam Hockstra, keeps the ball in play, pushes the setter back. 
Hooks it up, deal out to Bennett. Rolls it a little long. 3-6. Okay, Hawks down three points here. They keep the ball and play a couple of errors, a couple of service errors in the hitting there, and uh, passing there, and it's 3-7. So Trixie may be one point away from taking a timeout. I think he feels like they just need to settle in. Mm -hmm. Gonna bring a timeout. Three eight. Three eight. Not a great start for no, the Jayhawks. Not at all. They got a pass. Uh, yeah. Somebody's just kind of want to pass. They kind of floated through their first game, and I think they s settled in, and they get settled down a little too much, and just didn't really come out with any fire. Rotrix, he did change the lineup a little, so sometimes that has a little bit to do with it. So. But the bottom line is you still got to pass the ball. So in order to stay in contention uh, for the uh, league title, uh, every uh, every game's a must win for the Lady Jayhawks. Yep. Jayhawks need to beat GRCC on their home floor. Number 10, Isabel Brown, coming in for Raylan Sells. Looks like they might run 6-2 here, so they got to, once again, coming out of a timeout. Good smart play. To uh, get it out, Brown in for Moon, uh, Mon, Moon. Oh, I'm sorry, Caitlin Grabowski with the wrong seven. David High off the block. Nice set by Hoxtra. David played a little wise. She had everybody going the wrong way, just didn't find the court. So Jayhawks pick up a quick two points there. So out of the timeout, we go from 3 8 to 5 8, and Sammy Hoxtra. Good server, back to serve. Passed up to the setter. Block. Out. Nice dig. Good oh. play there by the Jayhawks. Oh. Six eight. Three quick points. You can't jump when you're passing the ball. You gotta stay planted in your feet and keep your platform still. She hopped when the ball got to her and then sprayed backwards. So seven eight, a quick four point run to put the Jayhawks right back in the set. Another tough serve, almost an ace. It picked up. Gonna Three ball coming. Ball. Bird picks it up. Brown out to Bennett. High off the block. Nice pickup by the lead, though. It's pretty yeah, good. Free ball. Another nice pickup. Oxtra outside to Bennett. Another nice pickup. Oxtra to Brown. Another nice pickup. Good rally here. Brown back. Good Brown there. to Brown. The Brown connection. Eight eight. 8-8, eight, eight. and so five straight points out of that timeout forces Lansing to call a timeout. And uh, so with that, that's a uh, full rate even. So the Stars' once nice lead has evaporated. Coach Emily Quintero calls a timeout to... Although some of the all very competitive points, so Jayhawks win the first set 25-18 in this best three out of five set match. Uh, Lady Jayhawks will be home next 
Thursday against Glen Oaks. We um, got the night off, so uh, you won't get um, the pleasure of hearing our commentary as our TV crew is going to shoot something for the city of Muskegon. Back on the 17th, the Jayhawks host Kellogg Community College, and then finish out the home schedule on the 24th against Lake Michigan. Oxford back to serve, another tough serve. Let's get yeah. another ace. Yeah. Sammy's done a great job of reeling in some points here for him. Six points in a row, 9-8. Jayhawks in front. Short serve. Oh, picked up by Hawks, bro. Bird picks it up. Good save out of the net there. Nice oh. up. Good play. Very good. Right there. Well, it's a little long, but a nice, really nice service run by Sammy Hoxter to bring him back into the set. Jayhawks with a 10-9 lead after being down 8-3. And the two back to serve into the net. That doesn't help when you're given an opportunity and you jam it in the bottom of the net. Bernie in for Brown. She'll go back to serve. Bernie out of Grand Haven, our hometown. Nice serve. Yeah, Might have been a double, double maybe, but uh -huh. I think everyone was wrong footed on that play. I wouldn't yeah. have I wouldn't have guessed she was gonna set back there. But. So 10-11. Another good serve. Hawkster passes it up. Out to Bennett. Brings it down the line, picked up. Another nice dig by Hoxha. Well, Bennett with a tip. Picked up. Back row attack. Berg right up. Back row to Bernie, and she sprays it out for 11 off. It's, you know, I'm thinking that Berg is going to make a good Libro at the next level after this year if she wants. She's a good passer, really quick, has a nose for the ball. Yeah. David, eye off the block, picked up. There comes Brown around and sprays it long. So it's not that they're not getting to run the plays, they just haven't found the court. So getting good good balls getting up towards the net. So that's getting a nice pick up by Brown. Over the, no, he's got to call that one. Not, not listen pretty. 12-12. Rouse for Bennett. Nice swing by Bennett tonight. And Shelby Rouse gets the call to go Trixie. Nice deep serve. And give him a free ball from the lead draw. I don't know why she would put the ball there. But gives him a free ball right to their lead libero. Throws it into their setter who puts it in for a kill. 13-12. Roush Jayhawks back up. Roush back to serve. Back to David. Good block by Brown there. Go yep. for a sub. Sub one. Who's in here? Number nine is Mackenzie Kent. Who's in? See if Coach Rixey tries her out, hold off the bench. Rouse sails it a little long. So 14, 13, 13 14 with the Libero. Anna Whiteman back, sir, 5'7. I don't know if she's 5'7, but uh, from Holt High School, she does a great job. 5'7 or not, yeah, that's, that's the right call. That wasn't pretty either. So we're tied at 14s. Jayhawks need to settle in here and get that couple point leader. I, I feel like they're going to drop this set. Uh, yeah. 
Which this is not a bad Stars team. Yeah. Oh, good high off the block. Good stick. Take advantage of the small. Outside Robbie's just really athletic and jumpy. So Julie Brown back to serve. 15-14. That's a double. Yeah. Picked up, set her out. That's a block. Brown picks it up. Veal's going to go out to Berg, who's and shoots the Finding gap. Finding all the open spots in the gaps. And He's having a really nice match tonight. Um, Coach making some subs, trying to change some things up. Change some momentum without calling a timeout. He does have, each coach has one timeout Momentum's remaining. Right. That's up. That's a little low. Picked up. Berg rolls it. Picked back up. Sneaks it through the block. She was there just kind of reaching a little bit yeah. instead of yeah. arms were there, feet weren't there. And Caitlin Grabowski from Nuego. Demi Hoxter back in. Julie Brown, Roush. Hoxter behind her to pick it up. Free ball in. Bernie puts it over. The setter outside. Nice cover. Great cover. Back in. Oxtra back outside. Uh, Berg. Close the block, slows it down, but they can't get it stopped enough to bring it back over. And Lady Jayhawks up 17 15. With Veal back to serve again. Passes up. Setter back. That's out. That's up. Well, we have to call a timeout, I think, here. Now well, we got a touch. We got a net. Who's in the net? Oh, uh, line judge called a touch over there in the corner. The other one. Oh, okay. And Fells has got to know when she's coming in the game. Nice swing there by Bernie. Yeah. Turn the wrist down. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know if they want to play or not, Rick. And <laughs> yeah, they weren't ready to go in there. Jayhawks up 18-16. Robbie Bird, keep this one in. Nice ace serve. Kind of a bad toss behind her. Had to keep it in and did a nice job of doing that. Because if she would have swung full force on that one. Would have been in the middle of the net probably. 19-16, and now a timeout by Coach Quintero. So, good time to spread a three-point lead for the Jayhawks late in the second set with a set in the... Uh, we'll see what happens and come out of a timeout. You guys are just joining us. The Jayhawks took set number one, 25-18. Up 19-16 in the second set, going to 25. Best three out of five. We'll be taking a 10-minute break after this set. Do a little serving competition. We'll let the teams get uh, a little bit of rest and catch up and change the strategies up. See if they've got anything to, if they can have to hang around and make us worked a little extra tonight or been pretty lucky this year to have mostly three set matches. So. Robbie Bird back to serve out of the timeout. The 1916 lead in set two. Off a little bit in front of her and a little low. So Haley Gartland comes in for Berg. 17-19. Passing two right now. Big hole in the middle. Oxford fills that quickly out to Bennett. Picked up. Oh, got a talk. Oh, nice swing. Off the hands of David for 20. 
Grabowski out, Brown in, Hoxford back to serve. Hoxford last time she was back there had a really nice run to bring the Lady Jayhawks from 3-8 down. Brought them right back in the front. There's somebody who just didn't, Aaron Cooper just did not move her feet. She's got to move to the ball. You can't wait for it to hit you. So. Be out of rotation here. Yeah, they're confused to say the least. We got a someone setter. new setting right now, or? I don't know. I'm trying something. She's going to try and find somebody who can uh, set the ball, I think. So I think she's doing a good job setting. She's doing a great job covering yeah, setting. I think the it. problem is the blocking. Right. But that doesn't help when you're five, four, yeah. and a setter. There's something about volleyball coaches is they, uh, she says that uh, she's 5'4", yet number one's 5'7", so I don't, I don't know. Volleyball coaches and heights aren't, aren't one in the same in my opinion, but I would have to agree with that. 22-18, Bernie had a nice serve, passed right up to the setter. And that violation there. She got she's got a, she's got a swing at that number five, but she was up there too. Yeah, she was. All she's got to do is just tap that to the back right hand corner. Yeah, exactly. 23-18, two points away. Kennedy Bernie are back to serve. And a short serve, sprayed sideways. Nobody home to put that over. Jayhawks looking like they're going to be able to take set number two here. Just need one more point. A little confusion on communication, so 24-18 and once again, uh, Lady Jayhawks having the position with a handful of those set points to go up to set zero. Bernie with a great short serve, but it just was out. out. Yep. Had him sleeping, but just a couple inches out. Good thought. So 19-24 and uh, Sylvia Strike back to serve. Cleaned up by Cooper. That'll work, I guess. 2024. Yeah. Strife back to serve again. Another set point. Bennett, nice bump set. Good spot. Yeah. Nice one arm dig. There's been a lot of those tonight. Picked up. Uh, by David. 24-21. Coach Rixie just going to let him side out one more time. Maybe one more point and we call that timeout. Oh, but got Bennett and Brown on the front row. They should be okay. Pass up. Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> nice up. Nice up. Elbow. Oxford. For the kill for 25-21. Not pretty, but it all counts. We're going to take a 10-minute break. We'll see you back in a few. Okay, folks, we're back from that 10-minute break. Some kids walked out of here with some Jayhawk volleyball gear. And we're ready to set the, the start the third set. Jayhawks up two sets to none. They won the first set 25-18 and grabbed the second 25-21. Jayhawks just need to win this game or set to 25 points to walk out of here with a win. Lansing needs to win three games in a row. Joby Rush back to serve. Passed up. Picked up by Hoxstra. Berg. Nice block. Good cover there. Free ball coming. Pushed up. Oh. The nice nine's a little answer. early, you know. Berg with a tip. Picked up. Oh, she's going to swing at that one. She's just a good athlete. I don't know if she plays anything other than volleyball or not. Wouldn't be surprised. She's really athletic. One nothing Roush back to serve. And 
Tough serve. Outside, number 10. Four contact. Right call there. Do nothing. Good short serve. Picked up. Good block. Jayhawks off to a quick three. Nothing. Start. Well, set was a little behind her. And there was two blockers ready to greet her. There was no, uh, nobody was fooled on that one. Nope. Roush back to serve. Grabs the net. For 3-1. Side out. Number nine. Mackenzie Kent back to serve for the Stars. 1-3. Real Bird puts it in play. Picked up by the Libra. Outside. That's out of bounds. Looks like they're hitters are early, don't you think? They're a hitting the ball bit. way back here. Sets are a little on no the high side. Yeah. Inside, off the net. Two, Alana Man tie in. Judy Brown back serve with a 4 1 lead here in set three. Good serve. Picked up, back. Oh, not going to work. Number 10, Morgan Daly sticks it in the net for Mason High School for 5 1. And the string of errors to start off the third set does not put the stars in a good light. Another good. Nice little back. Tip by the setter, picked up, but no. Cooper, Roush gets there, but nobody not, else. Nobody there, there to help, so three Jaslyn Maxson back to serve the setter. Down 2 5. Just set, Roush pass up, heel out. Bird rolls it down the line, picked up by the lead bill. Good angle swing yeah, there by number nice. 14, Maya Brooks, freshman out of Holt High School. I had an intern that went to Holt High School. All-state wrestler. Whoa. Caught Bernie up in the chest, didn't get out of the way, so she had to try to pass it. And maybe the old five. Maybe the old head high let it fly there, but no, that's right. <laughs> Bird, Bernie, a nice pass up deal out to Bird. She's going to swing. Good Should've deal, good deal off. off the bad set there. Kind of yeah. pushed outside a little bit off yeah. the net. Good angle shot by Robbie Bird. Wheel back serve up 6 4. Again, set three. Ugh. Three ball, Hawkster up. Veal back to Bird. She's got one blocker, and that blocker gets her. Maya Brooks, first time Robbie's gotten blocked tonight for a kill anyways, and also down. Alexis is set back in the game, Rail and Sales back in the game. Jay Hux, up 6-5. Third passes it up, comes up the middle, just snakes through between David and Brooks, they were both there. Bird back to serve. Up 7 5. Nice pass. Up. Deal. Barrow's got that one a couple of times tonight, but uh, just a little short there. If she was really 5 7, she might have been got able to that get one. that one, right? <laughs> Bird back to serve up 8 5. There we go. But her four is passed like that twice, and it's actually worked out pretty yeah. well. Brace the ball off. So, 9-5, a four-point lead for the Lady Jayhawks here. Third up. Still good. Good spot. We got a timeout coming here if I'm Coach yeah. Emily. No. Just going to let him go one more. Yeah. Okay. Hey, pass the ball. Fair yep. Achilles heel really is ball control. Bird, another nice serve. There's the pass she was looking for. Nice back set. Nice good by Bird. Picked up. Oh, Bennett through the block. 11 5. 
been thinking about a timeout, but I don't think she's going to call it. I would with Robbie Bird back there serving. Yep. Put her. That one's out. Yep. And she was hoping for that and got it finally, but it cost her a few. So I'd trade three points for a miss every time. Four Cooper back to serve. Nine. Ten Chin. Bird, nice pass up. Veal out to Bennett. Uh, with nice She's gotten better throughout the season. Yeah, she has. Well, she went to outside. She was playing right side last year. I think year. that just slowed her. Well, she was playing right side at the beginning of this year. I think it just kind of slowed her arm swing down a little bit. She was yeah. waiting for that high looping set back out. Yeah. And in that short distance, yeah. not as easy just to get the ball thrown out to you on the outside. David. Oh, sneaks it through cells. It's got to be a block. Yeah. 12 7. Strike back to serve. Passed up by Berg. And Bennett Good finds the ball. I don't no. know. She <laughs> came running up yeah. like Cooper's she was going to skip it short. Yeah, Cooper's got to do a better job of playing left back defense. She's just been kind of caught in no man's land. Yeah, she must. Maybe she doesn't play much defense. Yeah because she was just way out of position. Bernie a back serve, nice serve. David picks it up. Libro puts it in. Veal. Lock, picked up by David. Bennett picks it up. Veal back to Bernie. Picks it up. Libro picks it up, sets out. And David high off the hands of Julie, Bennett for a kill. Julie Brown's just got to press her left hand there. Yep. Mm -hmm. Whiteman back to serve. Done a nice job. Libero for the Stars. Puts it in. Berg. That was a good play, though. That was a nice right. serve there. Good pass. Right idea. Yep. Just, just didn't ex execute yep. it. Jayhawks just kind of need to... Stay with 13. those consistent side outs here, I think. Yep. Learning a back. Oxford keeps it in play. Yep. Didn't clear the net again, I believe. Oh, that's a tool off the block and there. Did he get the block there? Yep. Redirected in 13. Bit. Yep, Bernie, huh? Veal bump sets it to Bennett. Picked up. Almost uh, just throws the ball there. I'm not I'm not sold on that. There's a tip. And there's a throw. No. Yep. Because as soon as you slow down that motion and then redirect and go deep when it looks like you're gonna go short, that's yep, I, I don't think that's right, but yeah, pretty good go clean play. They just gotta speed things up a little bit, yeah, and I think right. they'll that works with her. Number ten. Morgan Daly finds that elusive kill in 11-14. Only three back. Roush picks it up. Brown. Shout to Cooper. High off the block. He's going to let her try again. Bernia picks it up. Veal. Brown. Free ball. Picked up by Whiteman. Back out to Cooper. Through the block for a kill. Jayhawks just need another side out here. 12-14. Kench back serving. A little momentum going and puts in the bottom of the net. The set in. Hoxter out. Brown back to serve. Up 15-12. Heading down a home stretch here in the third set. Brown serves in. Fast up. Another head high, let it fly there, yeah, especially when right. you're six foot. Yeah, exactly. Well, 13-15, kind of a gift there, so. Sutter Maxson back to serve. And the Roush for service ace. Okay, Hawks, this is where they need to focus in, or they're going right. to right. drop this yeah. set. Yeah, they, uh, and then it's in anybody's hands after that. Yeah, they just get a little... 
Get him. It's a good serve. Robbie Berg, high touch off the hands. Yeah, we got a touch over in the corner there. It's the right call. 16-14, yep, heel back to serve. Line judges doing a pretty nice job tonight. Yes, they are. So we got Berg in the set. Bernie on the front row right now. Her service winner. Put it in between the Libro. Whiteman and Manti didn't get it up, so... They pull within two and, and give up an easy one. So picked up by Roush. Veal back out to Bird. She's gonna swing. The block. Back in her first back. Oh. Number 14, Myra Brooks. It's a nice set. Good swing there. Good rally. Morgan Daly back to serve. 15-17. They're still within striking distance. Sells in. The set in. Nope. Oh. Not gonna work. That didn't help. Nice for us. Stay and hot. Pushes Berg to the back row, but also to her serving. So Bennett in. We got Bennett to set and sells in the front row. Robbie Berg back to serve. Up 18-15. She grabs it. 19 15 Gonna call a timeout. She got two hit two. Two left. She, sh she should have called one earlier, yeah, but she, she I, I think she thinks she did. <laughs> Jay Hawks up 19-15 after winning the first set, 25-18 in the second set, 25-21. Well, it sounds like, it smells like they plugged in the crock pots for taco night here. Uh, yes, they do. They do that a couple of, a couple of times a year. The parents bring stuff and let the teens stay afterwards to have a couple of tacos and some donut holes or something and send them home. After that timeout, we set the clock for you. We have uh, they all up two sets to none, up 19-15 in set three. Robbie Berg back to serve. Good serve, passed up by White. Men. Good high contact there, good back row attack. Cooper, a little cutty, finds a hole, 16-19, Kench in for Manti, and we have Cooper back to serve. And ball's picked up, Sutter brings it over to the Libro, and Veal out to Bennett, who hits it long. Not a very good jump there by her, and no. she still tried swinging full force. 17-19, stars within two. Passed up by Hoxka. Bennett's going to better it. Here we go, number nine's going to take a swing at it. Berg brings it up. Geel out to Bennett. He goes cross court. Cooper brings it up. Kent's going to swing. Veals out of the play. Berg out of the back row. Cooper picked it up. Oh, Kench keeps it in play. Berg again. Veal. We'll get Bennett with a tip. Set her out. Oh, that's right. And Kench puts it deep to the corner. Berg runs through it. Picks it up. Oxter's got it. Takes the setter out again. Kench gets it across. Oxter's going to set. Veal. Big point here. Yeah, that's right. Oh! Madison David says, we're coming. So 18-19. Nice 18-19, great rally there. Jayhawk need this side out, in my opinion. Yep. A little shoe tie going on here. She's ready to go. It was a great rally. Cooper. The Hawks are nice set. Goes to Bennett, picked up by Cooper. Back set, nice back set. 
We're tied at 19. Maya Brooks. Coach Rixie going to take a timeout. Yeah. That's where they need to focus in, get a pass. This is kind of that rotation, I think, though, yeah. that they get stuck in. Yeah, you're right. Consistent to the outside. Yeah. Bennett likes to hit in that same spot. Number four, Cooper, there, just picking, picking them up. picking it up. Yeah. Yeah. Back to serve, tied at 19. Good deep serve. Nice pass up by Bird. Done it out of the middle. They just didn't. Good side out. Sprays it off the block. A set out. Brown in. A little more offense for the Lady Jayhawks with Sammy Hawks for one of their better servers back. Point scoring servers back serve. Good. Nice pass up. And brings Woo! it back. Nice, day. nice swing by Sylvia Strife. She goes back to serve and it's 20 all. It's a game to five. Jayhawks need a side out here. Picked up by Hawkster. Back to Bennett. Two tips. Oh, yep. He's got to call that. Yeah. That's the right call. Yeah. Maybe somebody in the net there, but yeah. why I'm back here announcing instead of reffing. Ernie up, back to serve, up 21-20. Timeout on each side, I believe, still left. Good serve by Bernie. A Cooper out to Kent, swings it. Berg brings it through Must Bennett. Be a nice point for the Jayhawks if they could get it. Ooh. it up. Cooper in the back row. Ooh. That's a good dig there. Yeah. Bennett. I'm not sold on that. Not but at all. Not at all. I think that's a throw myself. He's Time taking out. it and going out and 22 20. But like you said, we're just announcing, not roughing. So. Great job by the Jayhawks Sound, their first outing this year. Nice to have them back. We don't have the guitarist here today, so no smoke on the water, but we'll have to do without that for us old uh, 80s rockers. So, Kennedy Bernia back to serve with two point lead, 22 20. We're in a home stretch. Lady Jayhawks three points away from a three set sweep. See what happens. Puts the ball in play. Back out to Kent. It's out. Swings hard, but nobody at home. So, two points away. 23-20. Bernie -20. back to serve again. See what she does with this one. It's out as well. Just missed. She wanted the ball, she passed it and said give it back to me. She hit over the block, just set it out. So we got four match points and Bernie are back to serve for, for the match. David passes it up, they're gonna give it back to her. And she just puts the block kill. and but she goes out, so. Jayhawks just need a side out here. Whiteman back to serve, side out for the match. 124, balls in, Hawksford passes it up. Oh, lots of bodies over there, that's good to see. 22, 24. So 
Coach Rixey calls the timeout. Coach Rixey going to make uh, make the server think about it a little bit. This game a little bit closer. Twenty-four, twenty-two. Lady Jayhawks need one point to get the broom out and sweep this season series with the Lady Stars, winning in five over in Lansing and trying to win in three in a sweep here at home to go nine and one in conference play. Jayhawks seeing if they can keep and extend that conference record to nine and one. As, as we told you, the, uh, they'll be in Grand Rapids at the uh, Grand Rapids Invitational Saturday and Sunday for those of you who want to follow your Lady Jayhawks there. And then next Thursday, they're home against Glen Oaks. Uh, Athletic Director Marty McDermott gave us the week off, so we'll, we'll see you in a few weeks. Uh, but we wish the Lady, Bucks, Lady Jayhawks well. And then Whiteman back to serve. Yeah, nice, nice serve. serve. Yeah. Well, that's not going to get it done. Setter bumps it to Kent. She's going to swing hard. Bird here's, here's the chance right up. here. A little off the tape. Bennett, high, and hard. 23-24. Yeah, well, everybody's tightening up a little here. So the Whiteman again, 23-24, puts it in. Hockstrip puts it up. It's low set. Yeah. Cooper runs through it. High off the block, and we got a tie ball game. Big point here. Jayhawks had four match points. They've waffled away, and Berg back to Brown. Ooh. He would like to redo that one yeah. if he could, but good run nonetheless. Whiteman. Rouse Rouse back to serve. serve. Good server for the Jayhawks. Once again, uh, fifth match point for the Lady Jayhawks. Maybe Rouse back to serve. Good serve. Nice pass picked up. And Kent sneaks it down the line. Yeah, for 25. Man tie in for Kent. And we're tied at 25. So we got Roush and Bernia and Hoxter back to uh, receive. Uh, Good quick uh, serve. Uh, gonna get a free ball. And who are they gonna go to? Uh, Ooh. Not the net. Ooh. Yeah. <laughs> Julie Brown. Set in, Brown back. Grabowski yep. goes in for a set. We got Berg, Veal, and Grabowski in the front row. Julie Brown to serve. And six match point for the Lady Jayhawks. Oh. And that's going to do it. Yeah. And that's the match. Lady Jayhawks win in three, 25-18, 25, 25-21, 25, 27, 25 to go 9-1 in conference play. Talk to you later, ladies and gentlemen.